I'm delighted to join you today. As head of marketing and sales for ABB, I have seen firsthand the importance of China to the robotics market. But today, it's my honor to address this conference for the first time as president of the International Federation of Robotics, recognizing the importance AI will have in the growth of robotic automation. You will have heard yesterday the president of ABB Robotics and Discrete Automation, Dr. Samia Tia, outlining some of the reasons why this will be a decade of transformative change in manufacturing automation. From labor shortages driven by demographic change to supply chain uncertainties and sustainability development needs. Today I'm able to share the latest preliminary IFR data on what this means in numbers for the growth of robotic automation and the influence of AI. And of course, as I will also show you today, China is accelerating its path to one of the most advanced and automated economies. Before we get into details, let's make sure that we are talking about the same thing. Here are recognized definitions for both robots and AI. Robots are physical systems, programmed, actuated mechanisms with a degree of autonomy to perform locomotion, manipulation or positioning. We distinguish between the industrial and the service robots. There is not one universal agreed definition for AI, so we point out the AI definition by the European Commission. Artificial intelligence usually refers to software or algorithms. Artificial intelligence systems are software systems designed by humans that act in the physical or digital dimension to achieve the given goals. While both robots and AI are separated technologies per se, there is a certain overlap. AI used in robotics, sometimes also called embodied AI or smart or advanced robots. And it's important to note that both of these areas and the overlap are growing. So how does AI help robotic automation? Because it opens up new possibilities, particularly in an environment with high variability. In manufacturing, AI is enabling the automation of a number of tasks that have previously only been possible to do manually. This includes picking, placing and manipulating of objects, from machine tending to assembly, which robots can now learn for themselves, sparing employees sterners, heavy or uneconomic tasks. AI is also becoming well established for robotic quality inspections. And an AI-driven robotic application brings greater efficiency and flexibility to logistics and retail, enabling companies in these sectors to cope better with peaks in orders high product variability and an often unreliable labor supply. Beyond industry, robots are increasingly making their mark in the public domains, from hospitals to shopping malls. And in the future, AI will enable better interaction between robots and the people and objects they encounter. However, it's important to note that these changes will take some time. There are significant advancements in AI algorithms, such in the types of objects the robot can recognize when performing a particular task. However, a complete robot application involves many more program components and interfaces. For each application to be commercially viable, the cost of automation has to be outweighed by the uh, productivity or other gains. In many cases, it will necessarily be years before the development we see in research labs gain widespread commercial adaptation, but we can be very sure about that they will come. We can see the robotics industry in strong recovery, generating greater flexibility and resilience for a range of industry, enabling by AI and connectivity. We expect these trends to continue and develop through the next decade, as these technologies really are revolutionizing manufacturing. Thank you.